care of my hair here as we uh, got to the end of last week, so it's ready for the first week of school. Okay, so. good. I was at least Good. proactive in that regards, right? Uh, temperatures out there right now, plenty warm. It is muggy as you're walking out the door this morning. Temperatures in the mid 70s, 76 now in Waco, 74 at Temple and in Killeen. A few low 70s out in the hill country. Now, as we go through the day, it will be toasty again. 89 by 11 o'clock, 96 by 2 and later on this afternoon. Should top out pretty close to 101. That south-southeast wind hanging around 10 to 15 miles per hour. The only spot where it might be cooler is out to our west. There's some tropical moisture working through, so mid 90s towards Burnett, 100 in Lampasas, 101 in Gatesville. The rest of Central Texas really looking like those 101s to 102s along I-35, 99 to 101 along I-45, and a little warmer in the Brazos Valley where the center of that high is closer to 102 to 103. Radar really not showing much here locally. We are watching a little tropical disturbance down there across South Texas. It has brought five to seven inches of rain there south of Corpus. Likely won't be seeing that here, but as this works off to the northwest as we go through the day today, it is possible we see a little isolated shower southwest of Waco Temple Clean. The rest of us stay dry. Our next chance of rain comes in as we get into Wednesday and Thursday. That's when a weak cold front will come in, bringing an isolated chance of rain Wednesday and on into Thursday. It won't really cool us down much, but by the time we get into next week, there are some signs that pattern breaks down a lot. We could get a better cool down coming in by the end of next week that could send our temperatures down into the mid-90s. Here for the next three, though, we're going to be around 100 to 103. There's that cool down next week, guys. 95 to 96 possible. All right. Looks good, Josh.